Here we have the second generation Honda Ridgeline. We're gonna go over the top five problems on it. All vehicles have their problems. Let's get into it. Before we get into the problems, if you need any car parts for your vehicle, you can click the link in the description and it'll take you over to 1AAuto.com. Now let's start with problem number one, the fuel injectors. The symptoms you may have with this condition is the engine running rough. You may even have a check engine light that's flashing. Now from the factory, there is a updated program for the computer. There's something called a technical service bulletin, which means that Honda knows about the issue and they have a fix for it. What they're gonna do is go in and reprogram the computer and that's gonna change the values in the fuel injectors. And if the injectors are too dirty for them to just clean, they're gonna have to replace those injectors. After all that is completed, your engine should be running smooth and your check engine light will be all set. The next problem we're gonna talk about is the timing belts. Normally timing belts are maintenance items and you're gonna have to replace them somewhere between 80,000 and 100,000 miles. Well, with this vehicle, there's actually a problem with the timing belt. Honda knows about it and they made a recall on certain vehicles. So you wanna check with your local Honda dealership with your VIN number and see if your vehicle falls under that recall. Because if this timing belt breaks, it's not gonna be good for your engine. And another problem is the backup camera. The symptoms you're gonna notice is the backup camera not working at all, completely blank, or even cutting in and out. And the reason for this is, if you look right here, you can see where the wires come out from the bed and go into the rest of the truck. And there's a lot of movement in those wires, especially when you're opening and closing the tailgate. And the other reason is because the tailgate opens this way as well. So you may notice a wire break right there. You just need to repair those wires and your camera should be good to go. Now we're under the vehicle and another problem you may have is a fuel leak coming from the fuel tank or even the fuel feed line. Now there happens to be a recall for this as well. You're gonna to wanna to contact your dealer with your VIN number and see if your vehicle qualifies. So if you see fuel or smell fuel, get that checked out. And the last issue we're gonna talk about is the O2 sensors, specifically the downstream O2 sensors. Those are the ones that are after the catalytic converter. You most likely will not see any drivability issues with this since it's only monitoring the catalytic converters, making sure they're doing their job. You're just gonna have a check engine light with an O2 sensor code. Those are the O2 sensors that just monitor the catalytic converters, letting you know that they're working properly. And if you need these O2 sensors, you can get those at 1AAuto.com. So there's our top five problems for this Honda Ridgeline. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you subscribe to our channel, ring the bell, turn on all notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. Ridgeline. The symptoms you're gonna notice is the camera not working at all, completely blank or even cutting in and out. You're just gonna get a check engine light giving you a check engine light. <laughs> <laughs> Do it again.